And so what I'm asking you to do is to find ways, creative ways to make individual contact with an individual who is struggling in active addiction. You don't have to look far. I promise you, it's probably somebody that you know. It could be a family member. It could be somebody at work. It could be somebody at the bread kitchen, the soup kitchen, whatever you, 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 you look for, right? For me, it's easy. I drive around a lot during the day. I know what I'm looking for. So for me, it's not hard to stop my car, to get out, to make a relationship of trust, right? To talk about opioid addiction, not hard for me because I've been doing it. But for other people, that's, that's a task, and I know it's difficult, but how about getting on your social media and going through your contacts and going through those people who are having a hard time that you kind of backed off because they're going through it and start making contact, start sending messages out. Now, I understand that if it's a toxic situation, don't do it. Find somebody else. That's that simple. But what I am asking you to do is spend 10 minutes a day in making these daily contacts. Now, Facebook, great opportunity. Instagram, great opportunity. TikTok, great opportunity. Uh, these soup kitchens, great opportunity. Street contacts, great opportunity. Family members, great opportunity. Um, man, rehab centers, great opportunity. Uh, and I promise you, the more you make these contacts, the more you reach out, the more comfortable you will get. Now, what I do want to, what I do want to hesitate is if you are not comfortable making street contacts, please don't do it. Don't put yourself in jeopardy. Uh, just, just because safety is paramount, right? And, and do we know the individual, what they're going through, where they're at in their active addiction? No. So, my recommendation is slow that down a little bit and, and try to do some observations, but start in house first. Okay. Start in house first. I hope this helps you. I hope this gets you on your way. I know this is just a short blurb on what we're doing. Again, this is to the initiative to take 10 out of your day to go spend it with somebody in active addiction. Okay. And that can be through Facebook, social media, text messages, phone calls, street contact, whatever it is, go make an impact. Look up. Have a nice day. Thanks for checking us out. We'll see you soon.